We begin tonight with a disturbing crime. An indictment was unsealed today, charging former Erie County Democratic Party chair and well-known political operative Steve Pidgeon with raping a child. Now, the charges are the result of an investigation which began a few months ago into an incident alleged to have occurred around this time back in the year 2016. We hear more now from Channel 2's Dave McKinley. David. Scott, the DA says he believes Pigeon may have gotten suspicious that he was under investigation just after police began looking into the allegations in August because shortly thereafter, it's alleged he showed up at the door of his accuser's family asking why they were no longer taking his phone calls. After turning himself in and being booked at the state police barracks in Clarence this morning, Pigeon was taken downtown where he then appeared in an Erie County courtroom wearing jail fatigues and chains and pleading not guilty to the charges. District Attorney John Flynn says the allegations involve a girl who was under the age of 11 when she claims Pigeon assaulted her five years ago, but that the allegations only surfaced this past summer when the alleged victim told their mother, who then contacted her family attorney, who then contacted Flynn. I believe the child. I'm standing with the child and I'm gonna give the child justice. Do you have anything more than the word, an allegation of a child? That, that I'm not gonna talk about any other evidence, but yeah. I have but I have her word though. Okay, do you have, have anything more than that? I'm not asking yeah, no, yeah, what no, you yeah, have, yeah, 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 but I mean, you, you, you must to bring a charge like sure, this, yeah. no? Yes. So here are those charges, predatory sexual assault against a child, rape, criminal sexual act, and endangering the welfare of a child. Conviction on the top counts alone could land the 61-year-old Pigeon behind bars for the rest of his life. Pigeon's attorney moved to have his client released on his own recognizance, but the judge handling the arraignment ordered him held without bail for now. We do expect Pigeon's lawyers may make another bid for bail to be set at his next court appearance on Monday. Dave McKinley, Channel 2 News.